Today, we decided to leave our policy interest rate unchanged and to continue to reduce our securities holdings. Looking ahead, we are in a position to proceed carefully in determining the extent of additional policy firming that may be appropriate. Our decisions will be based on our ongoing assessments of the incoming data and the evolving outlook and risks. Inflation has moderated somewhat since the middle of last year, and longer-term inflation expectations appear to remain well anchored, as reflected in a broad range of surveys of households, businesses, and forecasters, as well as measures from financial markets. Nevertheless, the, progress, the process of getting inflation sustainably down to 2 percent has a long way to go. We're prepared to raise rates further if appropriate, and we intend to hold policy at a restrictive level until we're confident that inflation is moving down sustainably toward our objective. Again, we we're in a position to proceed carefully at this point. Uh, a year ago, we proceeded pretty quickly to get rates up. Now, now we're, we're fairly close, we think, to where we need to get. Um, uh, it's, it's just a qu question of reaching the right stance. I wouldn't attribute huge importance to one hike uh, in, in macroeconomic terms. Nonetheless, you know, we need, we need to get uh, to a place where we're confident that we have a stance that will bring inflation down to 2 percent over time. Um, I've always thought that the soft landing was, was a plausible outcome, that there was a path, really, to, to a soft landing. I've thought that and I've said that since we lifted off. It's also possible that it, the path has narrowed and it's widened, apparently. Uh, ultimately, um, it may, this may be decided by factors that are, that are outside our control at the end of the day. But I do think it's, I do think it's possible. We, we will restore price stability. We, we know that we have to do that. And we know the public depends on us doing that. Uh, and we know that we have to do it so that we can achieve the kind of labor market that we all want to achieve, which is a, 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 an extended period, sustained period of strong labor market conditions that benefit all. We know that. The fact that we've come this far uh, lets us really uh, proceed carefully.